The Claiming Book 3 of The Circle of Caridwen Saga, Volume 3 Written by Octavia Randolph Narrated by Nano Nagel Preface There is peace now in the Kingdom of Wessex, and a stay from the war and waste which too long ravaged our lands. This is the peace that our good Elfred wrought with Guthrum, King of the Danes. Elfred shared out the land of Angleland so that the Saxons kept some of it, and the Danish warriors took and settled the kingdoms they had conquered. At Kilton, my home for near these ten years, three Yules have passed since the battle at which so many of our folk fell to Danish iron. Burnt timber has been renewed, and the mark of spear and sword sanded away. Yet our losses have been great and though others have filled the empty spaces at the tables massed in the timber hall, the ghosts of those gone be ever amongst us, and the wheel of life, like the wheel of the year, has turned, exacting its toll, war or no. I am a woman, my name is Keridwen, and this summer I shall have twenty-six years. Chapter the First Leave-taking. The year 881. The merchant ship to carry me to Four Stones lay at anchor off the spindly pier. I had travelled overland to Swanowich with my son carriage to meet it, and the thanes were even now carrying aboard our hide-packs and food-baskets. I stood with Godwin as he eyed the ship. "'I do not trust him,' Godwin said of a sudden and I did not have to ask who it was he spoke of. I took breath and said, "'He has kept the peace. Elfin has written me about all the good works he has done in Lindesay, even to building up the nunnery at Arndel. He has been quick to adopt our ways, and been just in all his dealings.' He did not answer any of this, but turned his gold-flecked eyes to me. "'You must promise me that you will be cautious with him,' he asked. I did not want to follow his path, and simply said, I am Elfwyn's guest, not his. It is her company and comfort I seek. Kerich was just at my side, and I did not want his uncle's unease to make him fearful of the Dane, to whose stronghold we journeyed. I made a little gesture to him, and Godwood nodded. The ship to bring you back will be at Saltfleet on St. Mary's Day, he said again naming the point on the coast of Lindesay at which we would be picked up. Sample complete. Ready to continue?